All right, so it's been about a week exactly that I've been trying the five hour work day. And today it took me take me five just over five hours five hours and 45 minutes and that's including driving to the warehouse today so uh left the left the left my house at about 4 30 in the morning and then got to the truck at five drove to the warehouse that took me about two hours and 15 minutes total so from jumping into the truck going to the warehouse and then coming back and then I managed to get all my other stuff in just over three hours so three and a half hours it took me to do my work my actual work so from that perspective that's pretty good usually it takes me about eight hours six to eight hours in a day and on a Friday it usually takes me at least eight hours uh, average is probably more like 10 hours so last this past Friday I did seven hours and 50 minutes which was that was pretty good I was pretty happy about that I was done around 11 ish in the morning and that's again that's rare for me on a Friday so uh, what what I do is uh, I'm not trying to speed up how I'm working because to me, that's not sustainable if you just work really super, super fast all the time. But what I did was this morning, I drank a cup of coffee and I had a glass of water and that's it. That's all I had. Usually I go to Tim Hortons, grab a cup and then at work, I'll grab another cup of coffee, that kind of stuff. So this time it was just a cup on the way to work and one glass. And then once I got back to my first call, I just uh, began working and I didn't take a break or anything like that, which was good. Actually, I did have one bathroom break. That was because I had a late meal last night. I had chicken wings after eight o'clock. So it kind of seems like 12 hours. It's pretty good, and then I have to go to the washroom in that range. So I think the moral of that story is whatever I eat tonight, let's say if I have supper at 6 o'clock, probably, yeah, I'll probably be going to the bathroom first thing in the morning when I get up. Maybe when I get to the warehouse. I know it sounds kind of weird, but all this stuff takes time. So if you're if you're drinking a ton of coffee and you're going to the washroom, let's say two, three times a day, or if you're smoking, I don't smoke, but if you're smoking, you got to take a break, smoke a cigarette, that all adds up. So when you think about it, you can easily save a half an hour just on bathroom breaks alone. And then if you become a little bit more efficient when you're driving, like when I drive in one area, I try to always get to a situation where I'm always making a right-hand turn whatever my next call is that way I'm not waiting for the lights to change I can just stop and then go so <clears throat> yeah that's it so so far so good you know I'm sticking within five to seven hours which is pretty good because then that means it's a decent week but my goal is to try and shave it down to 25 hours but one thing I'm running into right now is I don't have a plan for the afternoon. Like I watched a little bit of wrestling on TV. I've been listening to uh, some uh, some of my audiobook as I'm doing stuff around the house uh, with the Dr. Disrespect. I've been reading the book as well a little bit. And uh, I took my dog over to my daughter's house to go let out her dog. So it's interesting that you could fill up with other things if you don't have a plan. And maybe that's part of the idea is uh, to be able to work in five hours 
and then do something else, whether it's exercising, going for walks, hikes, whatever it is that you normally couldn't do because you're working. So that's kind of interesting in itself. Yeah, so there we go. That's kind of my update. So this is basically day, I would say this is day five of doing this because I started last Tuesday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, and then today. So tomorrow I don't have to go to the warehouse which means I can just go directly to work and start working, do my first call, all that kind of stuff. So I'll just keep documenting this. And if I notice any significant change, I'll let you guys know that as well. But uh, yeah, that's pretty much it for today's video.